Hey guys, it's PSR1986 and today I've got a video for you which is not particularly a glitch. I would say it's potentially an exploit but more importantly I think it's just a tip for those of you that are here to make XP, make some ammo etc etc. So if you're interested in that stay tuned, this is what we're going to be doing. So you want to set up your perk cards, you want to be setting these so that they're in line with crafting, gaining XP etc etc so uh, I've got my bandolier on I have got my charisma and intelligence perks up I've got ammo smith on and I've got super duper as well as a few other bits you can take this you can use this perk card loader if that's what you want to do then what you want to do is you want to make sure that you're on a team it's a public team with high intelligence potentially four people if you can do that lunch boxes can beach stew live and love eight bobblehead leader all these other little bits that can give you that little edge on your xp then what you want to do is obviously this is aimed towards people who've got a lot of steel pretty much from the previous exploits that we've done i know uh, glitch unlimited and smart glitch gaming both have done some pretty extensive videos on xp farming i think mr risk has done them as well actually so go check them guys out for content but pretty much if you've got a high amount of steel this is going to work brilliantly for you and then what you're going to do is you're going to use a slider to craft a load of railway spikes let's say so we're going to craft these railway spikes like so and we're going to keep doing this okay now i'm only going to do this three times because i want to show you what this glitch or this little exploit is uh, <clears throat> so let's move over here right now i have got 9,000 railway spikes okay we're going to come to our ammo converter and we're going to start converting these into something else so well, into points should we say so we're going to go to other low power ammo which is railway spikes and you'll notice you can only sell 300 rounds at a time and it's really long-winded you press X on here it gives you this you've got to press circle to go back you press it again now if you get pretty quick and you're pretty good at this you can go X circle back X circle back blah 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 blah, blah. it's really slow what you what a lot of people don't know and this doesn't use up or give up extras or anything like that it literally uses everything that's in your inventory you can go to the railway spy camo and you can spam X like two three times boom, 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 boom. Okay, so it says there, I was on 12,900. When I back out, I'm on 14,900. So I've just gained 2,000 ammo points when really I've only just clicked on it once to get 1,000. So we're going to do it again. Spam your X, press circle. We're at 16,900. Spam your X. We're at 17,900, 18,900. Now I run my PS4 on an SSD, so it is fast, it is really quick. And my internet's relatively quick too for where I am in the UK, but I know that some people are using a PS4, whether it be the slim version or the older version. If you have got a slightly slower cons uh, console or you've got more lag in the server, you can increase that yield so that you can get more clicks in. On my setup, I've managed to get three to four clicks in before now where I can sell maybe, where I can gain 4,000 ammo points, which is selling around about 1,200 rounds. Now, it doesn't sound like a lot, but in, the, in comparison to X, weight, circle, X, weight, circle, it is miles, miles quicker. So basically all you wanna be doing is spamming the X, circle, spamming the X, circle spamming the x and before you know it you'll be out of rounds i did it before i was like i had thirty thousand rounds on me and i was like okay it's telling me that i can't do any more why is that and then i looked and they were all gone it's like super quick anyway i hope you find it useful it's for those of you out there who are using the ammo crafting with the slider to gain xp and then using the points in the ammo machine to get the ammo for the gun that you're using so for example for myself i'm using a um, dragon a non-legendary dragon with 999 ammo um, it needs a lot of repairing but uh, i'm in the process of getting my hands on some tses so i can just come on out here and i can do the 50 caliber balls and i can buy them and the same process works for them as well so i can spam that and i've just bought a thousand instead of buying just 500 spam it well i can't actually i've not got enough points but basically the same process works when you're buying as well that's it guys i hope you found it useful like i say it's not a glitch i suppose it's a weak exploit at best but in reality it's just a little tip for those of you that are out there doing the xp farm when you're using your crafting bench all right guys thank you very much we'll see you on the next one